centuries before the birth of Christ, the citizens of the Greek city-states and those of Persia were uneasy neighbors. And by the end of the 6th century BC, many of the Greek trading settlements in Asia Minor had fallen under Persian dominion. Two Persian military expeditions were beaten back by only the narrowest of margins at Marathon, at sea near Salamis, and at Plataea the following year. With the unifying threat posed by the Persians thus weakened, the victorious coalition of Greek cities dissolved into vicious infighting. Meanwhile, Philip II of Macedonia was building a powerful modern army with more heavily armoured phalanx and heavy cavalry for mobility. By 338 BC, Philip had conquered the whole of northern Greece and the remaining Greek forces moved to counter this new threat at the Battle of Chironia. Having crushed Greek resistance at Chironia, Philip installed himself as the head of the League of Corinth. This gave him control over all the armies of Greece, and he immediately set about his long-avowed desire to reclaim the persian rule Greek cities in Asia Minor. In 337 BC, Philip sent an advanced invasion force under his most experienced general, Parmenion, across the Hellespont to establish a foothold in Asia Minor. But in 336 BC, Philip was suddenly assassinated and his young son Alexander had to move quickly to establish himself as undisputed king. Alexander immediately had all suspects executed and then marched to Greece where he summoned a meeting of the League of Corinth and forced the city-states to confirm him as rightful heir to Philip. He then quelled minor uprisings in Sparta and Athens before turning north to quash the unruly barbarian tribes. And when the city of Thebes rebelled, it soon learned what would become of those who dared defy Alexander. He razed the city to the ground and enslaved the entire population. For the time being, Greece was pacified and Alexander turned his attention to the east and the Persian Empire. The advance force under Parmenion had been held up by the Greek mercenary leader Memnon, who was fighting for the Persians. When Alexander arrived with an army of 40,000 men, he immediately confronted Memnon at the Granicus River, 